SpaceX's crewed launch originally scheduled for tomorrow evening has been pushed back 24 hours to Sunday night due to weather and we are counting down to the new launch time. SpaceX blaming onshore winds and trouble with recovery operations for the delay. Yeah, the company says the launch is now Sunday night at 727. News 6's James Barbero is on the Space Coast tonight. Their second to last night in quarantine, the Crew-1 team of Mike Hopkins, Victor Glover, Shannon Walker, and Soichi Noguchi, now scheduled to fly on the first full-length SpaceX astronaut mission on Sunday night. NASA just announced liftoff is moving from tomorrow night to 727 Sunday. Administrator Jim Bridenstine breaking news of a 24-hour delay due to onshore winds and recovery operations. We looked carefully at the weather uh, and the onshore flow looked really uh, not so good for Saturday. Also, we needed to get the, the drone recovery ship in place to recover the booster. And even with the new delay, Elon Musk I mean, might really still be absent from Kennedy Space day. Center. The SpaceX founder says he might have COVID-19 based on test results yesterday that came back both positive and negative. Musk is usually at all major KSC SpaceX missions, but if he does have the virus, NASA's administrator says he's expected to enjoy the launch from home. The astronauts are expected to arrive at the International Space Station Monday now and begin life in orbit for the next six months. We're launching four astronauts to do very real and serious work on behalf of the American people and on behalf of humanity at large. Bridenstine on the achievements of working in space during a pandemic. We are advancing medicine using the microgravity of space in ways that you cannot do here in the gravity well of Earth, compounding pharmaceuticals. At NASA's Kennedy Space Center, I'm James Sparvero, getting results news six.